I love it. Yo, your body parts. Your body parts are acting weird. Gosh, that yeah. works. Hey there, friends. So this video, we are gonna check out different bunk beds from CC Bunk Beds to the new bunk beds released by EA. We're gonna experiment and see what we can do with the uh, help of our anime Sims here. Hello, Sarah Cruz. Is Princess Sarah anime? I like that car, by the way, the Mercedes Benz that I mentioned in the previous video. Oh, wait, whatever that is, I have no idea. Whoa, mixology skill? Oh, where is he? Yo! Oh my god! What is happening to the house? <laughs> By the way, this is my first time to play Paranormal. So, um, yeah, I, I'm kind of surprised. Anyway, let's, where will I start? I'm going to start off with the mods first. So, hello, Raymond. So, this is Bunk Bed by Sandy of Around the Sims. So, as you can see, the, the bottom part of it is um, usable, is functional. Yeah, it has some interesting <laughs> animation though. I like it also faster than climbing over here my only issue with this bunk bed is that you have to make sure that there's enough space for for this area for the chair part but other than that yeah it's it's working fine also yeah Dante DTM yeah fan <laughs> so Sarah Chris and Dreamon are a big fan of Dante DTM anyway all right so Okay, that's pretty interesting. Hisoka and Krolo becoming friends. Hisoka, since you're there already, I'm gonna make you test that area. I don't know this. You can drink here. I use the globe in Sims, Sims Free Play, but it's like it's literally like just for logic purposes. I don't remember it being used as like a cocktail party thing. Yeah, that that that's a that's a really <laughs> interesting animation. I'm not complaining. I seriously like it. So yes, like that. It's working. Fortunately, we can only use single bed for it for this. I feel like there's like an animation boundary. I'm trying to not like put a bed here that won't go past that animation boundary for this double deck bed. I'm gonna be surprised if this starts to work now. Oh, see, it doesn't work anymore. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, maybe because Lavinia is blocking the way. Wait. Oh my god, Sarah Crew, Jesus. What about nap? Oh, they just sat together. That's so cute. Okay. It doesn't work. Only only single bed. Anyway, let me test. Hisoka try sleeping here. So this is bed uh, double deck bed by and also this discussion is by Necro Necro Dog. And also very interesting animation as well. Alright that works there's a reason re really interesting reason why necrodog decided not to put um like not to put a space here like a um, functional shelf instead like so let's see i'm gonna try putting like a uh, chair let's see if they can use this as pc put a mac there nice this looks like a like the older like the, the, the PCs in internet cafes 10 years ago when that was still a thing. Oh my god, that's so... Yo! Oh my god, that's so satisfying! This makes me so happy! Okay, that is so cute! It literally feels like having like living in a dorm or like if you're like role-playing as a landlady or landlord or something. This is awesome. Like you have multiple roommates in a room and oh my god this is epic you guys i love it i love it uh, i've seen a couple of recent sims videos about bunk beds where ea won't let us do this but i've discovered like a workaround for that which i'm gonna show later on anyway let's go down here at the basement first so this is another one of my experiments so i'll make jabami are you okay all right so if i make Yo, Lavinia, wake up. So I'm sleep here. By the way, so this the, the frame here is from around the same Sandy from around the same as well from her IKEA pack. But she has foam for this bed, but I didn't use that because the foam for that she mentioned that it's functional. But for some reason, I think probably newer updates broke it, so I couldn't make it work. So I used Necrodog's foam for the upper deck for it to be usable. This is the problem with this one. 
like it follows the animation for this frame if you don't mind that then it's all good but if you're like pretty picky with the animation and with the inversion then that's gonna <laughs> that's hilarious <laughs> i'm gonna show why this doesn't work and the work around for this to work so like if you use sleep it won't let us for some reason or at least yeah it First, I thought maybe the animation for moving in and out of this chair might be like conflicting with this, but I already moved this bed a bit. I tested it here as well. Um, initially, this was like a bed, but I couldn't make it work either. So the trick is I'll make, I don't know, no, not nap, sit first. Actually, nap doesn't work. So I'll make him sit first. Yeah, and that's the trick. And then I can make him nap. What if I sit and sleep? Oh, I can't. This, so this is this is the bed foam for this bed bed frame, rather. Let's see. Maybe because. Oh, not either. What about sit? Come on, sit, Moriarty. All right, and then I make him sleep. Oh, we can only make him nap. Oh, unfortunately, that's that's the limitation for this one. Only sit and nap, because I guess the animation. There's something with the animation that that prevents us from doing so like a certain animation goes beyond the boundaries of the single bed it's not gonna work when it's nap they just have to do that but when it's sleeping they have to do like this this animation thing it, it's the, the the box the animation boundary the animation box expands at least that's what i think i'm not really sure i'm not a techie so so for sofas it works because they can take they can nap and stuff we just really have to <laughs> stick with this really interesting animation also for, um, for some reason there's a, like a glitch like weird glitch every now and then when I when I move a certain distance people who use Necrodog's foam I think there's something with the tuning or the recent updates in the sims might have caused that bug let's now move on to EA's bug bed this, this bed, I don't like it. It looks sturdier though. This railings it reminds me of hospital beds. I don't know. I, I don't like it. But anyway, that's just personal preference though. Others like that. I don't. The Raymond is so cute. Oh my god, it's so cute. <gasps> Yo. Yo. Your body parts. Your body parts are acting weird. So be people of object for that bed. So, oh by the way, um, this thing, you can't. We can't put anything actually under this bed unless we, we enable testing cheats and turn on BB move objects. If so, obviously the sleep thing is not gonna work when there's something over here. We can just do that. Yes, now it works. Yo, hospital bed. Don't like that because this chair has like a certain animation bound. So if I put anything there. Um, crosses over the animation bound for the ladder. If I move like that, let's just copy this chair. And like probably if you, you want to use it, this as like something like just a decorative bed. I know this is this this is gonna work. Yeah. As long as this, there's there's enough space for the seam to squeeze through here, that's gonna work. Oh my god, the Raymond is so cute. Yeah. If I put this cabinet over here, it's not gonna. Oh let, let me see. Actually, I haven't tried that. Are they gonna be able to use the cabinet at least, even though... Uh, plan outfits. And here's a Camaro. Take a nap. Sulanai. Oh my god! I didn't know that we can... Oh! Okay. Nice. But... Like, let me show you guys this another thing. If like if you put anything near here, it stops working. The bed is not usable anymore. So let me show you. Hisoka, we do the honors. Oh yeah. Okay, I put the shoes over there. Yeah. I gotta move the shoes or any thesis that you wanna hang right near this this boundary here. If it's like over here. Where there's the animation for the cover, the duvet, the blanket. As I was waiting, which sim is gonna like move here 
and look like a fan of PewDiePie. <laughs> no, but no sim went here on their own. I guess none of my sims is a fan of PewDiePie. But actually, we can put any plants here and it's still gonna work. Let me show you the world. See, it's still working. All right. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna work anymore. Also, who wants to put their plant there? Let's see. Oh, so yeah. See, it's similar to these shoes. Like, if you put anything near the animation boundary, but if you put behind it, then it's it's okay. So the the chair is kind of far away from this. Unfortunately, I still couldn't make it work. They can have, but we can we can sit. We could use the computer. Yo, what happened to? You? Okay, Kermit, stay there. So the rule is, no, nothing should get past this boundary if we put anything here or we won't be able to use the bunk bed anymore. Because that works. Unfortunately, we can only take naps. We can't sleep. So yeah, I think that the EA will fig figure it out eventually. I think they just need to like, make a separate animation sleep function, like sleep to bunk bed or something <laughs> in C++. And then, or probably mod it with Python or something. They're, they're almost there. Now I'm waiting for the spiral staircase, which is a whole issue altogether. Let me try sofa. Oh, I don't think it's gonna work because th this one, there's there's like an animation boundary here and I think it's it's it crosses here, but let, let's see. Oh, yeah. But if I put the sofa like that, nice. Oh, oh. Okay, I want to try something. I don't think this is gonna work because the animation here for uh, like moving here and there for this chair, I think it's gonna like cross over here. Oh yeah, see, doesn't work. I think that's not gonna work. Yeah, doesn't work. But if I if we put the storage like this, yeah, now it works. Cool meow. Yes, yes, I knew it. Oh, well, we can't because of the shoes. We can just remove the shoes then. Yes, we can. Nice. Nice. That is so weird. Just the weird, just the weirdest. Anyway, he needs to stand up for showering before he can lie down. I like with the toilet. Okay, I guess that's it for for testing the bunk beds. Now I'm gonna just um, do a quick tour for this little horror house. So this is by Parisus. I mean the, the shell rather and then I'm furnish it. So we'll take a quick tour. Welcome to the Amityville Horror House. Welcome to the neighborhood. Hi. <gasps> Oh my god, Beltagon is visiting us. Hisoka, call some butler to entertain the guests for us. Hello, welcome. Oh my god. Also, oh, Illumi is here. Oh my god. Illumi is here with the front cake. Oh my god. I can't believe Illumi is bringing fruit cake for us. I mean, of all, of all people. Don't trust that dude, but anyway, it's Hisoka's best friend. Oh my god. Alright, let's join the guests. Okay, this is the entrance, the cafe, cafeteria, common kitchen, Raymond, wanna help Hisoka, I mean Moriarty here. No, anyway. They all started, they all started cooking. Since the guest is here, maybe I'll, I'll hire a vendor. So where are we? So this is like uh, another, <gasps> oh my god, what do we do? Mop mysterious symbols. Anyway. It's just like a storage area over here. Yo, we barely, we rarely visit this area and it's already haunted. Jeez. And just a shortcut for the, for the area over here. Anyway, now if you go up, okay, we, so there's a, like a stairs here. Going to the basement. Wait, I forgot to like hire service. Butler. There you go. Now we have a butler. We got an awesome DJ here. So this is where they do experiments and stuff. If we go up here, I'm not very comfortable with these stairs. It's pretty narrow. Okay, me, okay. Why are you floating like that? You you creeping me up. Oh my gosh, it's horrifying. So if we go to this area, so this is another common toilet and bath. Oh, what is our 
Butler look like? Hi, madam. Welcome. Hey. Oh, she looks very suspicious of this house. We go here. This is like their boarding area slash hangout space. If we go here, this room, this is the boy's um, bedroom. So, and then this part is the curly, curly area. Their own toilet and bath over here with access, with nice view of this weird lot over here. So, and then if we go here on the other side, this is, maybe I'll put the the butler here one of the beds i'll make him use the bed and then he has his old computer and then if we continue going up here we reach the attic where they can play oh my god jabami what are you doing not creepy at all eh that's my original watercolor by the way art art thing although i'm not actively painting yeah i'm just painting they can do spirit whatever serve the spirit some fruits so it doesn't like so it protects the house. Also, maybe talk to Julier. Also, summon the clown if they want to. They can also play cards with there. But oh my God, Jabami! Um, and then this is another bedroom. By this is supposed to be for Crawlo, but I'll let for for. I, I ideally I I plan this for Crawlo and maybe Hisoka if they want to sleep together. <laughs> no homo. Oh wow. So yeah, that's that's it. So far, see Martin where God plays Sims while somebody's eating. And in this cafeteria, that is fine. I wonder what Jabami ordered. Oh, it's ramen. Yes, ramen. Oh my gosh, we have the same taste. Yo, girl, you're like my twin. You're like my double gamer. School is stupid. <laughs> yes, Mart. I mean Moriarty. Wow. I mean, he's already smart. He doesn't need schooling. Nice. Hello, the Raven. Wow, she really assigned herself here. Oh my god, Jabami. I don't know you're into girly girly stuff. 